Welcome as we begin the third day of our novena. I'm certain that all of you are experiencing the graces flowing from Mary's hands during these days. Today, our theme will be the life of virtue. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit, Amen. Blessed Mary Immaculate was wise to perpetuate Christian virtue until her very assumption, when in great glory she was taken bodily into heaven, and there was crowned with twelve stars. The Rewards of Eminent Virtues I would suggest that we remember the twelve virtues as the fruits of the Holy Spirit. They are the fruits of the indwelling of the seven gifts. The fruits of the Holy Spirit are charity, joy, peace, patience, benignity, goodness, long-suffering, mildness, faith, modesty, continency, and chastity. We spoke in our novena of Pentecost of our Blessed Mother as the spouse of the Holy Spirit and through whom he comes to us. So in this novena, let us renew our surrender through Mary to the action of the Holy Spirit in our lives. Especially during these trying times, we need the gifts and the fruits of the Holy Spirit to keep us faithful to living our life of holiness. Father Justin Chinante, who gave the sisters their annual retreat, encouraged us to pray daily, Come, Holy Spirit. And so I encourage you again to renew that spirit within you that prays to the Holy Spirit through Mary. Come, Holy Spirit. We want to join our hearts to hers in praying to the Holy Spirit who will fill us with the virtues that we need to live these days in fidelity to truth, fidelity to our Catholic faith. Novena Prayer Hail Mary, full of grace, the Lord is with thee. Blessed art thou among women, and blessed is the fruit of thy womb, Jesus. Holy Mary, Mother of God, pray for us sinners, now and at the hour of our death. Amen. O Mary, assumed into heaven, pray for us. In the name of the Father, and of the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. Amen.